There are one million Americans living with Parkinson's disease. We are here with Dr. Ashok Sriram to talk more about the disease and some treatment options. Right, so Parkinson's disease is a disorder of the brain uh, where there is less dopamine in the brain. So the main treatment is actually to replace what's lost in the brain. So, but we use different modalities of treatment, exercise, physical therapy, or we call it as a big and loud programs, medical treatment, and there's all the surgical treatments are available for Parkinson's patients. So let's talk more specifically about surgical treatments. Surgical treatments, you know, um, when the medical treatment falls short, if we cannot able to control the symptoms just with medication, then we talk, talk about different surgical treatments. The two main treatments that are available as of today, one is called deep brain stimulation, where we put leads deep into the part of the brain and we stimulate it using a sort of a pacemaker. And uh, the goal is to disrupt the signals, the abnormal signals in the brain that helps to relieve some of the symptoms of Parkinson's disease. The goal is to help to improve the quality of life for our patients. And the second treatment option that's available is something called as Duopa pump where we use a pump very similar to insulin pump and pump the medication called levodopa directly into the gut. And this continuous infusion to control a lot of complications of medication that we use by mouth. Who is a good candidate for surgical treatment? Good question. So it's p patients who are symptoms are resistant to the medications, patients who's got a lot of on and off fluctuations with the oral medication that we use, or dyskinesia, as we call it, wiggling, which is the side effects of the medications. If you have one of these, you are probably a good candidate to explore surgical treatment options. 